<laughs> so Kendrick Lamar, you know, he announces album called what? Mr. Morale and the Big Steppers. Everybody in the hip hop Twitter is freaking out. Like, oh my God. Cause how long has it been since Kendrick dropped? Five years, something like that. The last album was what? Damn. And that dropped in, let me see which year. 2017, shit. The last time Kendrick dropped was when like Lil Pump, Smoke Perp, all of them rappers, Trippy Red were like first coming up. A lot of them have already fallen off. We've already seen Smoke Perp, like the, the downfall of him. But Jesus Christ, is that the last time that he dropped? Let me let me just make sure. Um, damn collector's edition. <clears throat> He's done like a remix or like a feature with SZA. But yeah, that's the last time he did the Black Panther soundtrack family ties feature with baby Keem. But Jesus Christ, Kendrick Lamar has been in the game for so long. I think that uh, why am I interested in lyrical rap all of a sudden? Honestly, I'm not. But Kendrick Lamar is a different breed in that he has songs where he isn't that lyrical. Like, bitch, stay humble sit down but good kid mad city the, the the magic about kendrick lamar is that he actually sounds really good without being a try hard with the lyrics like obviously sometimes he says big words but he says it in a simplistic way and that's why people i think like it because they can follow easy whereas there's all these other people who are like sitting there like you sound like you're rewinding on fast forward bro whereas kendrick lamar he's just he's just a beast now i saw some people saying <laughs> both kens are dropping on the 13th i don't know what ken carson is dropping something to do with like jason i think it would be like a single or maybe x-men i don't know he, you know, he he's very secretive with his hieroglyphics. He doesn't have hieroglyphics. He does like, I don't know, binary. He does the underscores and shit. He don't speak English. He did delete the tweet, but Ken, Ken Carson deletes every single tweet, even when he says he's dropping. And he, he hasn't capped lately. He's been giving us music videos, okay? Now, personally, if it's a single from Ken Carson, I'm probably gonna listen to him first. And then we'll listen to Kendrick Lamar, no hate, and shout out the Rocco for the bits. You a goat. You're sipping red, Jesus Christ. Uh, hopefully it's Kool-Aid, my guy. You don't wanna get a lean gut out here. You can get high, but I don't want you to get the lean gut. And co actually Kool-Aid will give you that lean gut as well because it got too much sugar. It's not good for your diabetes, bruh. But yeah, Kendrick Lamar, he's a beast. I fuck with him. Let's go over actually exactly what he said he shouted somebody out in hip-hop twitter it was on his website he like used it to promote the album on ken or what is it oklama.com and he has feet it's the founder of pg lang which is his label correct let me make sure that i'm not spitting any misinformation but he used it on rap talk sk okay let's check this out new thoughts what is this okay here's like the little email that he wrote to all of his fans los angeles from the desk of oklahoma which allegedly is what kendrick lamar we already knew this from like last year i remember making the exact video on it the following statement was released today by oklahoma through the company pg lang at 11 a.m pacific album mr morale and the big steppers release date 5 13 2022 so it's dropping on friday 13th hopefully jason don't come back from the dead from the lake that you know freddy krueger fucked him up in <laughs> and come and kill kendrick before he dropped that shit i don't want to put that into people's minds but it would be cool if ken carson outsold kendrick that's not happening. I think Kendrick, <laughs> what did Drake do? I think we're past the times of rappers like Kendrick and them selling like 500K. Drake sold what, a million with views, but people were still buying 99 cent iTunes, whatever. I ripped it, I, I, I used the leak people. That's when I was still doing local files. It's been a long time since then. 
Drake did what 600k I can't what did Drake certified lover boy do I honestly think here hmm so Kendrick almost is like a Cardi type in the the top dog situation with like Drake J Cole Kendrick I think those are the top three rappers at least sales wise please correct me if I'm wrong here because there might be some that I'm missing. Big Sean used to be in that big four, but he kind of like fell back because he got depressed and he stopped dropping as much music. He stopped like making music. He started making, I don't know, more emotional shit, which, you know, to each their own. But what did Drake? Drake, CLB first week sales. So Kendrick, what I was trying to say, he sold 600K, Jesus Christ. Easily beating Kanye West. I forgot about this. 613k first week i guess drake is just that guy bro but yeah i was about to say kendrick he's not as big as drake when it comes to like pop songs but kendrick has the ability to make big ass singles like drake like he has his fair share of top 10 hot 100 billboard songs um also with the weight of five, five years you know people might be coming out for kendrick plus here's another thing the people who listen to kendrick they like put on for the dude now i know merch bundles aren't a thing anymore but maybe in some i don't know old people will find a way to buy the album they'll find a, they don't even have a cd player but they're gonna buy the cd and then a cd player that runs on bluetooth or some shit and they're gonna buy this shit i could see it potentially coming close to 600 maybe passing it. it's gonna be in that same realm though what did j cole do on his last album of uh let's say j cole kod i feel like that was the last major i want to say like promoted majorly promoted album by him or maybe the one after that so j cole did 400k on that 174k coming from pure album sales so that's what it like j cole and kendrick are very like parallel demographics with the lyrical although j cole's a i don't know he's a little bit more lyrical whereas kendrick he's got like the baby keem side to him where he can like just bounce with it but yeah so kendrick lamar i say i say 450 to 500k j cole did 300k for off season but the thing about off season it was only like 11 songs so if kendrick lamar drops like 20 songs on an album he could easily get four 450 plus all of the hype again it's like cardi bro cardi on dialit did like 60k kendrick uh, or, or a whole lot of red did 100k now i know kendrick's already like at his you know he's already on top of the game so he's not gonna do much better than what was kendrick let's, let's look that up kendrick lamar what was his last album damn first week sales he did 603k what this dude is a beast but the thing is okay so May 13th is coming very soon. We're like one month away. So I would expect actually Kendrick to drop a single prior, maybe with like a music video to run up them single charts because he's not, he's not like the artist that's going to wait for a single to drop or to, to pop off and then drop the album like many people do because you know that's how that's how people sell albums nowadays they lure you in with the pop single but kendrick like he knows people listening no matter what you think you're gonna do he's gonna do 750 well let's check how many pure album sales are in this so i was joking before about the old people definitely gonna figure out a way to buy albums but what this was in 2017. So this was before merch bundles uh, were thrown out the window. And I don't think he's really selling that much like uh, merch. Like he's more of a music thing. Although a lot of people probably buying his shit, but I'm trying to figure out how many were pure album sales. But then those people are just gonna be, you know what Kendrick, he's gonna be like the top of rap caviar. So again i'm just gonna say like 600 actually four four it, it's such a range though god damn i don't even know 
do the old school inhale i can't bro i am not i am not that guy i am not that guy pal four to five hundred that seems like a good good range it really depends too like if he comes out of the gate i don't know mate you know how old is kendrick at this point like 30 no he's more than 30 he's like 40 at this point I'm not trying to say he lost it because I feel like Kendrick always comes out with a bang and I don't think he would drop it um, without knowing that this shit is going to go off. Like he just has that executive producer mindset. I mean, he's always involved. He probably executive produced somewhat with Baby Keem's last project. What was it? Blue or some shit. You know, the soundtrack to Black Panther. So he's still involved. Like he's still with the times. But the what we always talked about with Cardi or like other or even Uzi, like when you wait five years, like it's kind of risky because you don't really know what people you're not like staying in the relevancy with the fans. So if you do drop some trash, you lost my guy. You're done for. Not actually, though. Kendrick is a goat. Like he'll go down as a, a goat. So it doesn't even matter.